Were you recording that? Yeah. yeah. Oh, Where are we? We don't have to. We don't have to. We edit that. No, 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 no. <laughs> Show my talk, true colours. He's talking a big game before the podcast. <laughs> yeah. We got like, we got my half Asian brother here with yeah. a flip knife, like, threatening me. <laughs> flip bottle opener. <laughs> yeah. Get it right. He wishes it was a knife. Yeah. He actually carries a knife on him at all times. Oh man. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. You just got to think, what would Cosby do? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he's there on the wall. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Make sure that's why we brought our own drinks. Okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Can't yeah, spike it if there? it's sealed. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Well, we're sponsored by um, V Energy Drinks. Hey, yeah, yeah. yeah. I've, yeah. I've heard you boys are uh, sponsored by a few energy drinks. Shout out to V. <laughs> what happened to what happened to Bang and Monster v, and Nah, V for vagina. Oh. <laughs> Fuck yeah. What about Rockstar Ooh. for? Uh, 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 what, uh, uh, I'm gonna be. <laughs> <laughs> uh, right, <he's> <laughs> Rockstar rage. <laughs> the best. Shout out to our uh, good friends at Rockstar. Yeah. Why? Friends. Why didn't you bring? Rockstar. Because today we're getting sponsored by the energy drink. <laughs> <laughs> the. That camera's not on, a, is it? Yeah. Is it, oh, is it on? Okay. Is that yeah. a you're, GoPro? Is you're talking no. directly to the uh, CEO of V. <laughs> <laughs> what, have, what have you done there? How come you've like half cracked it? Uh, oh, this little trick. What's it called, Rich? The sweet slit. Of the, the bee. The sweet slit of the okay. bee. Okay. Um, doing it since I was about 12 years old. Okay. It's creepy. Uh, <laughs> it's, is it called the sweet slit? Yeah. yeah. So, so you said slit. it's the sweet slit of the V. It's the sweet slit of the V. <laughs> is it uh, drug protection? Yeah, well, it, it helps when you've got Cosby. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it would have so, saved so many lives. It's uh, so that, yeah, you can't get roofied. Yeah, everybody is. So, uh, so you're drinking it like that? Show I, thought it, I thought it must have been to like let the gas escape or something. I don't know. <laughs> some, some no, like, since I was 12 years old. We all used to drink it like that. I mean, well, you know, we had a little gang, yeah, and we all used to do it, and everyone stopped because they grew up. Yeah, <laughs> as you can it. see, I opened my yeah, gang yeah. fully. But, but why isn't it restrictive? It's restrictive, but it, it allows me to nurture the drink like a glass for hours. It's beautiful. <laughs> no, no, he drinks it's it like hot. he's drinking a baby's bottle. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it sucks it. Yeah, yeah, can, can, yeah. You're gonna have to yeah, damage, yeah. right? <laughs> I hope the mic's slip. picked up that little. <laughs> <laughs> but this, do you just want to pull these just a fraction yeah. closer? You know, you know what's funny? I quit doing it when I cut my tongue once under the. <laughs> I don't think you're meant to put your tongue in it. No, you got to yeah. get under it. You got to you got to know what you're doing. It's, Mate, it's, it's, it he gives the best so, DJ. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds so complicated. Well, I'll tell you what the benefit is since I've had kids. Mm. Um, I've noticed a few advantages okay. because kids are always taking your drinks. Yeah. If I have a drink that down, it, my He's always trying to get my energy drinks, right? Yeah. So um, he can't really get to it quickly enough. I catch him if he gets a few swigs in. It's only a few slits, you know what I mean? And if he and if he and if he knocks it over, and my drinks is like, oh, you know, it's, a, it's like a six buck drink nowadays. Yeah, yeah. it's like I can save it. You know, right. use yeah. a little bit of the drink. So you know, I he guess what I'm saying. He doesn't have the sucking power of his old man. <laughs> no. Well, it's taken me forty years to yeah. get there. Right. Yeah. It's it trained a, those muscles. Yeah. Well, it is yeah. impressive. <laughs> you have to learn how to get your tongue yeah. underneath the lip gotcha. of the uh, what's that bit called the uh, the, the what, rim the rim yeah. <laughs> no it's not the rim it's the doing rim. a rim job it's, <laughs> it's the, what's it's that the little I think I would be pretty good at rim job <laughs> wait show me is what it, is that what's that thing there did you not so you uh, crack the tab and twist it the tab, I cracked the tab there I used to go from the front uh, but, but, but <laughs> now it's a lot easier rim. when you go from the back, yeah, you know what I mean? So now I go under. You gotta speak into the microphone. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, we're just hanging out. I'm talking about the actual microphone. <laughs> <laughs> so you drink it upside down and everything. I drink That's it upside fucking, down. So you do it all that dirt on top of the can. Oh, like, yeah. Off, yeah. I've seen some film. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when you go to Bali and you see all the drinks there, I still do it there. And it's, uh, oh. it's, you're playing with It's like Russian roulette. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's the AIDS Russian roulette. <laughs> How'd you get AIDS? Oh, the sweet slip. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I thought it was Bill Cosby. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Bill, Bill Cosby's sweet slip. <laughs> <laughs> He's sweet V. Because, um, yeah, as far as I've got, like, I was at a party in high school and one of my mates cracked his can and oh he God. just, like, twisted the tab. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And he, I'm like, why did you do that? And he's like, so I know which one's mine. Boom. And I'm like, it's really smart. So mm. then I started doing it. And he's like, Now which one's mine? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> he hated me for it. Was he a bit sick? Because like to think that way, you'd have to kind of be a bit of a, like a seedy person yourself. Like you know all the tricks. Yeah, yeah. Wait. Um, wait. Was what? it you? Was it you? No. <laughs> no. How, can you how can you make that call when you do the sweet slip? Uh, <laughs> yeah. It's a game over. Oh, it's game over for me now because I like the sweet slip. <laughs> 
<laughs> more people like the sweet slit of the V. I don't think I've ever seen anyone like that. No, I definitely yeah. haven't. Well, it's, it's you unique. know, if you guys want to give it a shot. Uh, I will oh, now. Yeah. But <laughs> I've only got a water and a whiskey. Careful careful of your tongue. That's yeah, yeah. I, I no, I'll, watch, I'll watch my tongue while I'm <laughs> rimming, rimming <laughs> the sweet slit. We'll this is not a podcast about sweet slits, is it? Like, come on. No, we we're listening <laughs> on the way down here. Um, Tom Ballard won. Oh, okay. we? Yeah, we... we Good yeah, job. We had to listen. How'd that go for you? <laughs> Fantastic. How'd you get Tom really? Ballard here? How did I get you guys here? Well, <laughs> <laughs> when, <laughs> when your standard <laughs> is someone that comes in with his own can, and it's half open, and he's sucking it from the rim. <laughs> yeah. Are you sure you want to rate your standard on us? Like, uh, you got That's us fine. here because. Yeah, yeah, no. Nah. We I give fucking, rim jobs. I appreciate you boys coming yeah. in. We didn't even get a fucking proper intro this week. I reckon we just go straight into no, it. No, no. Should we do it now? No, nah, no. Nah, yeah. It's fucking awkward now. Why not? It's not. Go on. Well, Let's see your uh, intro. Because that we can edit that whole half out. <laughs> no, well, I said rape like ten. That times. was our best piece of podcasting <laughs> yeah. we've done. Yeah, I'm, I'm feeling intimidated by my bro here <laughs> with the knife. He does. It's not a knife. That's why I have him here. Until it is a knife. <laughs> Until yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not a knife. <laughs> no, well, yeah, we got uh, Jay Wong and Richie Thomas in today. They're both uh, Sunny Coast comedians. Is that how you boys would describe yourselves? We we have a name. I, Huh? Yeah, just, no, did I thought, no, we have a, a title for oh. us. Oh, right, like, like a group yeah, name. Yeah, right. Do you want to say it? Uh, Hang on, let me remember it. Yeah. Do you want to say it? Um, <laughs> no, I'll, I'll say it. <laughs> yeah, you say it. Well, the comedy old school coastal kings. Was that right? No. Hang on. The acronym is COC. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, but it was it wasn't just you and me. It was me, you, and someone else. Yeah, well, yeah who yeah. was it? Gavroche. Oh, yeah, well, he's not doing it. When we started, doing <laughs> <laughs> we're just we we're just two balls chat. now. Yeah, just, yeah. Okay. It was just called cock. But uh, the acronym Coastal stand- old school comedy kings. Oh, that was it. Coastal, yeah, yeah. yeah okay. Oh, I've got it back to front. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Sounds like okay. Yeah, so it's yeah. a boy band yeah. that like we drink broke with up. the sweet slit mm. called <laughs> cock. <laughs> Fuck yeah, that's sick. Anyway, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. sunny we, coasters, yeah, sunny coasters. Yeah, yeah. Can we edit that last part, last, last part out? <laughs> oh, yeah, he'll edit that. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay, good, good. We Everything, can edit whatever everything. you want. Yeah. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think there's anything wrong with <laughs> it. We just, we just said that we give rim jobs and we're the cock. That's kind of weird, isn't it? I like it. That's what this know. podcast weird is based on. Yeah, I don't think I'd come on a podcast if there wasn't a chance of some <laughs> yeah. rimming or cock. Yeah, you yeah, know yeah. what I mean? Like, yeah, well, that's that's, that's I mean, why I got into comedy. Yeah, yeah. I mean... Not gonna lie, at one stage you two did have a podcast, and I remember it was like a was it a uh, it was like a scenario podcast you did. Yeah, work. yeah, and we got we basically found out it was like a very popular podcast yeah, for like, other people, and then we were like, oh, oh really? We were like, we got a great else. idea. <laughs> True. How has house. no one come up with this idea? <laughs> this fantastic idea. We we're like, no, yeah, what is it? And you were like, what? The idea was um, hypothetical. That was yeah, hypothetically speaking. speaking. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Those hypothetical cool. scenarios. No, we don't do Google searches before we yeah, actually yeah. just do fucking something. go straight That's into ridiculous. It. Yeah, we couldn't believe no one else had thought of it, and then about ten episodes in, we realised <laughs> that someone else had definitely thought of yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yet, like there was ten other podcasts with the name the hypothetically yeah. speaking. Yeah. I mean, there's millions of podcasts. Yeah. I mean, the chances of there being. Something similar. I think our we podcast, were surprised. No, we no. started at the same time as this podcast, didn't we? But uh, you've been consistent and we have uh, stopped at about 10 in. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Really amazing. 10 in. Yeah. Did you stop because you th- someone else was doing it? Or? Nah, we got lazy. Okay. Yeah. 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 Well, the, re- the reason I brought it up is you weren't so filtered on that one because I remember one of you were talking about like Koshi giving you a hand job or something. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, <laughs> I, think, I, think all, I think all the rimming and sweet slit is uh, good to go. Well, the, the, how the show would go <laughs> was like you would say to the guy, um, they had, you'd bring up a hypothetical scenario and they could mm-hmm. choose what they would do. I like this. And uh, with the Koshi is um, so would you, you get all the wishes mm-hmm. in the world, but, um, but if, you know, so you could have anything you want. <laughs> it's just that every afternoon at 2 o'clock, Koshi would come over and knock on your door and just be like, come inside. And mm. um, he'd lay Jason down. I don't know, why did you have to specifically say <laughs> me? Like, if it's a hypothetical situation, you could have said anyone. Well, yeah, it, could have been any, it could be anyone. Yeah. Um, in this particular scenario, it was Jason. Hypothetically. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay. And then uh, Koshi would um, put his tie in his shirt. You and, make um, it too romantic. Well, this is, tell, this, is yeah, this, okay. I mean, this is what hypothetically happened. Okay. So then, uh, <laughs> Koshi, <Yeah. laughs> then Koshi would um, he'd take his shoes off. And I would say, look, you're not staying long. So <laughs> I'd, he'd lay Leave Jason Put on. them back on. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he'd lay Jason down on the couch and he'd say, um, it's Koshi time. 
And then um, he dry hum, Jason. <laughs> <laughs> you stop saying my name. It, it's hypothetically could be anyone in the room, the person. Um, and that would go for 45 minutes every afternoon. But uh, he gets unlimited powers. Who does? Jason. But, but he just four. has every day at two, he just has to get dry hump by Koshi. But okay, I have unlimited powers. It's never two. What do you mean it's never two? Oh, yeah. I can take two, time. Two take two o'clock off the clock. No, that's, oh, that's, see, that's the rule. That's like, the rule. It's that's like the, the genie. Rule. That's the rule. It's the yeah. Aladdin rule. Yeah. 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 You know I tried I mean? to push it to a more convenient time. <laughs> two o'clock's right in the middle of the day. You know, I've got to pick up yeah. the kids and stuff. <laughs> yeah, it's such an awkward time. He's coming. No, literally. Anyway. Sounds like he is. Well, I don't know. 45 minutes is a long time. That is a long time. Yeah, <laughs> it, was like a, it was like a blue light disco. disco. Yeah, I'm grinding on you for 45. Anyway, I declined the powers. Okay. Oh, yeah. Well, I it. And I thought that, that was, was quite it. selfish because think of all the people you could have helped. Yeah. If he just let Joe Koshi dry hump you. And, you know. I, I refuse. He'd bring yeah. a spare. Is it like a dog him? on your leg? No. no. <laughs> it was too romantic. Yeah. That's what I loved about like listening to you two go back and forth is no matter what one of you said, it would just be this giant loophole, like, <laughs> why you couldn't not do this. <laughs> so much guilt. Yeah. <laughs> that was, it was, was it, two, two guys in a fake fire. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you changed the name as well, yeah, didn't yeah. you? You changed it. Because hypothetically <laughs> speaking, apparently someone else has thought of it. Okay. Fucking rip off. Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah. Anyway. Um, I think you should do it. He brought a spare pair of pants he'd come with. He's still he? going on about the Koshi thing. <laughs> I, <was> like, <laughs> I mean, Koshi might come on one day and he might be keen for it. Yeah. Have you heard of Koshi, the Sharp podcast? <laughs> yeah. 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 Wouldn't that, that be amazing if Koshi got on the Can't Get Any Worse podcast? Like, yeah. he's free now. He's yeah, he is free. Show. Mm. He's got plenty of time. Shout out to Koshi. Mm. He's yeah, a yeah. great guy. He is a great guy. That, um, that whole story just tripped me out because I've always just known you as Jay. But your name's Jason, is it? Yes, my That's real trippy. Name is Why trippy. is that trippy? I just it confuses my brain when I think somebody's name is their name and then it's com- something different. Right. Like yeah. it'd be your like your name being Malcolm. What well, is? <laughs> <laughs> what do you call him? Mal. <laughs> His <Yeah>. name's Adrian. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> oh, <is that> the <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> it's completely worry, different. Scratch the note. Okay, yeah. we'll edit that part. <laughs> yeah, out. no, we'll edit that as well. Have we got any podcast material yet? No, no, well, the no, whole thing cool. is just a giant edit. Yeah, we, yeah, we got some cool stuff for you. Well, you want to bring us in on? Yeah, yeah. On well, the subject? well, we've kicked off the last few episodes. It's like the little lane we're going down because mm-hmm. apparently every podcast has got to have a fucking direction now. Yeah, it's not as strong as hypothetically speaking. No, it's definitely not. <laughs> it's so, a great uh, idea. I don't we, think very many people are doing it. <laughs> <laughs> We just pitched to our, our guests to come in with a, like a story of like a moment in your life when it couldn't get any worse. Whether it's like fucking rolling a truck, drink driving or something, or just like a bad bomb or something. Yeah, well, we were talking the way um, – we, well, we didn't know whether it's – because obviously you got us both on. So yeah. we thought – just saying a little history about me and Jay. Yeah, yeah. We have known each other since we were 10 years old. Okay. Really? So That's we cool. grew up around – we actually were born in the same hospital in South Australia by a few weeks apart. Oh, okay. really? South Australia. Um, yeah. And then uh, we moved to Queensland about the same time, and then we went to the same school in Mooloolaba. So – we somehow have intertwined, and then there was that one time when we had sex. <laughs> <laughs> that, that never happened. Uh, oh, she was there. <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, so, um, yeah, so we, um, we've been around each other a lot, and so uh, growing up, we had, like, a little gang. Yeah we, we, yeah, we thought we'd tell you the worst thing that happened as a duo. Okay. okay yeah, nice. yeah. So, Sounds yeah. good. We, we got a this is how that, we, had a, we had a gang, and this is how everyone got... Forced to leave as a game. It was okay. horrendous. Bad time of life. <laughs> Is it as I don't, I don't think it's that bad, but oh, the, the consequences were, were impactful for us, yeah. It's not the origin. Do you want to start, do you want to start the story? It's not well, the origin of the cock gang, is it? <laughs> no, that's a how, many, gang. how many gangs are you guys involved in? And why are they all around cock <laughs> and rimming? <laughs> <laughs> why are you guys? The, the, the name of the gang it had a few different names. Okay. Uh, we, one of them was the Binnies. Okay. What was that? <laughs> Oh, because <laughs> we were all filthy and we all thought it was cool to call each other the binnies. And we used to jump in there. we walk around with no you, shoes. We used to jump in the video easy bin and uh, <laughs> get all the, like, all the front thrown away. Yeah, in the, the old school days when the rental was video easy, right, they'd chuck all, like, stuff in the bin and sometimes you'd get videos that would still work. And True. Yeah, so yeah, we're wrong. Binnies. Anyway, we used yeah, to yeah. go in the bin dive. Makes sense. Stuff. Yeah. How many people were in the gang? Oh. Oh, oh, oh yeah. well, we, let's just count them. It was me, you, Groves. 
Jason Groves. You started with he was the later. Yeah, but I'm just trying to. <laughs> <Go> on, <laughs> Groves, Groves, well, there's the two Jasons. You, yeah, well, yeah. I'm anyway, Jay Wong. There's three of us, and then there's Kurt, Max, Egan, Max. What was Max's? Uh, yeah, I know. No, what was Max's? Uh, he was the year below, but he was just hanging out with us. Anyway, Ben, <laughs> ben Harris, Scotty, Egan. Potty. Did I say Egan? Yeah, Black Eden. Egan. Black Eden. Yeah, Black Eden. <laughs> we had oh. Black Friend. <laughs> Sounds racist. <laughs> well, we had to distinguish him from the white. Yeah, yeah, no, fair, fair call. And he, he, this would have been back in what the nineties or something. Yeah, nineties. Yeah. He had a right for a ten-year-old kid. He punched like a twenty-five-year-old. <laughs> he had really? he was like, Stone. yeah, yeah. He's Vanuatu, and those boys they just hit puberty yeah. like when they're five or something. Yeah. And he was he had, had a beard. <laughs> <laughs> we were rocking. He was like, we were invincible with that guy. Yeah. So you know, we basically befriended him for protection. He's yeah. the muscle. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so he's a beast. Um, anyway, it's around you, nine you say people. Scotty Potty? Oh, Scotty Potty. Corey. Corey. <laughs> and Zurich Farm. Farm. All right. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Well, we got them all. 10. Yeah. Yep, perfect. So we're like, this, do you have you gang know, meetings? Yeah. We were. <laughs> <laughs> they used to, used we're to like get the Sandlot <laughs> kids. But, uh, you used to get these game. free things from 7-Eleven, <laughs> and uh, they were clips when you bought a Slurpee. Okay. And uh, the, it was at the time of the 90s, and uh, they are all different colours. Okay. So everyone got like one... Oh. You got your colours, and like we all got ranked. Ranges. We all had a number of like right. what number we were based on. You've upgraded joined. to the pink slip. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, this is a. This is a yeah. You carry on. <laughs> so, well, it was back in the the early nineties. We had this when it formed, and then yeah. it broke off in mid nineties. Yeah. Oh no! And so, what well, we we found this place. We we came across this this hideout, the okay. game place, and it was in the middle of the bush. Uh, and it was like a canopy, uh, a tree had fallen down another tree, and it, it was all this like uh, umbrella leaf trees, you know, those umbrella trees. Yeah, yeah. And it was like all secluded, and we got in there and we made this ultimate cubby. It was a big forest, like it sounds small, but it was mad. It was at the back of my house. Yeah, you had to walk deep in there, and then it came, it's like the secret garden, you know, <laughs> Fern Gully style. Yep, okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I just anyway. made that sound so lame. Yeah. <laughs> we went from. We had this gang. <laughs> It's called the Little Rascals. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's pretty rough yeah. growing up in the mean streets of Malula, yeah. uh, yeah. uh, <laughs> but uh, it, it was we had we engineered it out to it had a toilet. Tell yeah, like toilet. Uh, we would all hang out there. Mm. We we made a toilet. It was pretty gross. Because you, like, you walk all the way in there, mm. you can't walk all the way out. Yeah, yeah, for sure. So we made a toilet. Yeah, it was a toilet. It was like a high chair, and we took the roof, the seat off, oh, and no. we just sat on the bars, and we dug like a hole. So everyone would sit in it, and it was just like, it was like Geronimo, like nuggets just going straight into the dirt. People shat in it. Yeah, we, we shat <laughs> all the time. <laughs> what? And like, we used it inside the cubby. <laughs> and we used um, uh, I umbre- thought it was just, I thought it was umbrella just like leaves <laughs> are really good for wiping asses. <laughs> what the fuck? It's like not, a not each other. Don't shit in yeah. the toilet. I thought it was just going to be like a designated piss corner or something. No, no, but you guys were legit. Fuck yeah. yeah. The hole was at least, you know, one foot deep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we can hold at least three shits. <laughs> uh, we didn't like, you know, crap together or anything. Like we, we all went on our own. I mean, you could see each oh, other. Oh, dude, yeah. <laughs> there wasn't walls. Uh, anyway, <laughs> so uh, we all had our own little cubbies, and uh, and Scotty, we all had our own rooms. Yeah, and Scotty <laughs> was next to the guy? toilet, so he was Scotty Potty. Okay, okay right. Yeah. So uh, How did he draw the short straw and he'd be next to the toilet. <laughs> His name was Scotty. It's just Ryan, you know. Yeah. Uh, you have to sleep here, Scott. <laughs> it's in the name. Uh, so anyway, we would all hang out there, and um, you know, all mischief would get up to back there. You know, some guys would bring durries, and you know, you just whatever you're doing. You're we had a, we had a treasure trove of Pamela Anderson like. Uh, <laughs> Oh, Clippings, was, you know, in a Baywatch out outfit Pamela. where you can see her nipples. Mm. Yeah, right. So it was a uh, like treasure, like did it get kept near the potty? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it was next to the potty, <laughs> <laughs> but like the banana leaves and the <laughs> Pamela Anderson. That's place. because the sitting area, the old couch, is next to the toilet. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah the sitting area that was a weird. I don't even know. I remember where we got all this stuff. But uh, <laughs> it was just there. It was probably some old hobo's like, Bill Cosby's <laughs> yeah. hideout or something. Probably. But yeah, so we we had this like you know all our treasures. What else do we have in that box? I mean, we had trinkets and oh mate, we had uh, Spider Man cards. Okay, nineteen ninety four Spider Man cards. Marvel Fuck. Clear Ultra. Did you Marvel. keep them? I still got them. They're worth. Do you like, really? You know, the, I got the whole set. It's worth at least three hundred dollars now. Wait, <laughs> so you kept the box? No, no, it was just some of the cards. Okay. In there and, yeah. Okay. You know, you, 
It, it was a tragic ending. Okay. Oh, yeah, right. yeah. yeah. I'm, 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 I'm on the edge of my seat as to where this is going. <laughs> locked in. So uh, anyway, I can't remember. What's the next step are we missing here? What happens next? Uh, so, I mean, do you want to talk a little bit about the members or we'll just go straight oh, yeah, okay. so, well, through? Oh, okay. So, well, I don't know if they're that exciting. I agree. <laughs> yeah. Just kind of through it. A bunch of wieners. Yeah. 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 But, uh, like, I remember we, in that treasure trove, well, we, so had, all that can- we had all that uh, lollies. Oh, we had heaps of lollies. And it was right. weird because we, it's like, <laughs> we pooped where we ate. Literally, the, the toilet was right next to where all the lollies were. And the couch, apparently. Yeah, yeah that's right. <laughs> Fredo frogs, mate. They, go, they last for ages in the comic. Well, they're individually wrapped. Yeah. 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 Fair no, cool. we get the red and green ones, the budget ones. What? Maybe you just get the nasty red, red and yeah, they're not not the frogs, the frogs. Oh, oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. thinking, I was yeah. like, wait, what chocolate is red? <laughs> back, back in the day, we could buy a Freddo frog for like a cent. You know how you get two for two cents sort of thing, heart candy. Oh yeah, yeah. Those some good you guys, oh, those, those, those were the days. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, we got these lollies, and what we, what happened is it, it was Halloween, and um, everyone went off and got their like lollies. You know, me and Jay. Uh, that Halloween, I think we dressed up as the two-headed monster, which was a pretty bad idea. That was the worst <laughs> idea we've ever had in our life. Uh, we got this big shirt and um, one <laughs> pants. When, how do we do it? I can't even remember. Dude, the we were both in our undies and then we're in like a long costume. <laughs> we didn't need to be, but we were. <laughs> yeah, everyone was calling us gay. <laughs> yeah. We were holding each other's dicks for <laughs> stabilisation purposes yeah. only. Yeah. But uh, no, no, we weren't. Like, but... We no, were getting teased so you, bad. If you, if you tie your legs to another person, yeah. see, Halloween's all breaks. about you got to get places quick. Yeah. You know what I mean? Because the other kids, they get parts of it. Anyway, all of our mates, they all had they went as bikers. Okay. So they Sellouts. Just, they just went. <laughs> no <laughs> creativity at all. Nothing. They didn't even dress up, you know, but we were doing the headed. We went all in. We were, That was a great costume. Mate, we got egged. That night, multiple times. <laughs> and we couldn't run away. You <laughs> couldn't <laughs> run away. <laughs> we were getting, like, because our legs were tied together. We were holding... We were, we're holding yeah. each other by the shoulder. Like, oh, you looked at me, <laughs> and we had, we only had one arm. I think I was lefty. I that was a remember. bad night, man. And then, you know, we trick or treating. We hit like all our friends on the bikes hit, but hundreds of houses. We got to like ten. I oh, was we sweating up a storm too. Remember the dog attack? We that got it there, so and the dog had this dog. <laughs> it comes out as, as like a. Oh, you don't see it coming, but me and it, come, it starts running as we're, we're not quick enough to move away. So, yeah. what do we shield each other with? Each, each other. other. Yeah. <laughs> with, like, my picture is like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. and then eventually we just fell down. And the dog, the dog was right near us trying to, but it was chained up. But it was like maybe from me to Jay away. Yeah, it was just brutal. Go, and I remember the lady in the house, she opened a curtain, and I thought, oh, like, well, like, help us. And she just like, <laughs> She just looked at us and she looked kind of hammered, but she was kind of like, I'm not interested. And she just closed the curtain <laughs> and left us there with the psycho dog. Anyway, uh, I so. Was like, trick or treat, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Help a brother out. <laughs> anyway, because of, we tell you that story because that got us all the um, lollies, right? We had a, lo- a lifetime of lollies well, in there. We all pulled together. We had like. I bet you we didn't have much lollies. At the end of the night. We, we had plenty of eggshells. Yeah, okay. yeah. Well, you and I did, but the others brought yeah, heaps. Yeah, heaps. So well, anyway. We were stocked. So, so picture, picture, we've got this awesome cubby with mm, a toilet, yeah. heaps of lollies, Pamela Anderson up on the walls. Just just quickly. Just titties. Where was your where was your Fiji, Fijian friend where you, while you were getting egged? He was never allowed out. No, he wasn't oh, allowed true. out. Okay. He's we, got a garbage cubby. Yeah. <laughs> 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 where, were the, where was he? Where no, was he? He, he was, was never allowed out. He was one of those kids that was never allowed over for sleepovers. Yeah, We'd always okay. sneak him out and stuff, you know. <laughs> But, like, he'd get in trouble. His mum was hard. No, his dad was a psycho. He was a psycho. Anyway. Anyway, so, yeah, this place is kitted out. It's kitted out. Yep. And it also had a drum jumping tree, didn't it? What is a jumping oh, that tree? That was a bad story. That's, this is, that was the beginning of the end, the jumping tree. Oh, we'll come back to that. Okay. <laughs> so, so, anyway, we're stacked, and uh, me and Jay, um, we start wagging heaps of school. Because right? we have the place to go. <laughs> it's like, yeah. Your parents are you off to school? Yeah, we're going to school. It was at the back of my house in the forest. So I was just like, see your mum and dad, and then me and him would meet up and just go into the bushes. It was weird. <laughs> out the front door, around the side. Out yeah, the in, the two, yeah. in the two headed uh, giant costume, holding yeah. each other's dicks. You come back at the end of the day, and why are you so dusty? Yeah. <laughs> what did you learn at school about an excursion? Yeah. Uh, so we would hang out there, and um, no, what, what had happened is we started getting cocky because we at first we just did a few days, and then. My sister works, my, my family ran a, a, a business and uh, my sister worked as a receptionist 
And so I talked to my sister. I said, hey, if the school ever calls, because we're not at school, can you just cover for me and just say I'm sick? I'll do your chores for a week. Uh, yeah, I yeah, had yeah. some deal I struck <laughs> yeah. with. So she answered all the calls. So I felt safe that if the school ever calls, this is before mobile phones and stuff, yeah. right? So if the school ever called, I, I felt so confident yeah. that I was good. So I trusted in that. And Jay... My my mother, she's full Asian. Okay. <laughs> this is a true story. Like, you know, you're yeah. half Asian. But, um, <laughs> um, she was full Asian. Yeah. Like, immigrant and everything. Fuck yeah. And uh, her... English writing skills weren't that good. Okay. okay. So like she would, I would like, she couldn't even read. You couldn't like, get a hold of her either. No, no one's getting a hold of her. So I was, she would write my notes and sign it. And it would look like a two year old had written that note. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Brutal. So I just thought after a while, I was like, I started just writing the notes and just getting her to sign it. <laughs> okay. You know, I'm sick, you know, whatever. She yeah. didn't care. And eventually I was just like, I'm just going to forge a signature as well. Cause I do a better job. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm just handing notes willy nilly. And uh, I remember when we we had like how many weeks after we have? Oh, the the you talking about the streak. streak? The streak. It was the like legendary th- streak. We did about three weeks before. Three weeks went. without going to school, no question. <laughs> That's pretty funny. We get nuts. called into intense. the principal's office, different room, like good cop, mm. bad cop. They're mm. trying to like break us. And uh, I'll tell my side of the story, but I have a note. <laughs> yeah, they, yeah. They call my mum in. And uh, they eventually get it. She comes in and like she's sitting. And, you know, I look like a white guy, but you know, I'm, I'm half Asian. Like this guy. <laughs> and uh, and uh, they sit there and they, they've never met my mum before. And they said, uh, "Okay, is your is your mum coming in today? And why is the cleaning lady here?" <laughs> and I was like, <laughs> "That's Jake." <laughs> they were like, "Okay." They had all these um, notes out, and they had my pile, and then they had mum's original pile. And they were saying, look, these are obviously your mum's notes here. And this pile here is obviously your forgeries. And they, they took it out and put it on the table. My mum's real handwriting. Yeah, yeah. Like, your son's obviously forging these notes. Yeah. And my mum was like, no, that's mine. And True. I was all like, boom. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Got my back. Uh, anything else there, principal? And <laughs> not, they just fully embarrassed. Yeah. They let me go. And I was free. Really? Richie, Richie's story is a bit What's the name of that teacher that had the weird name that was gross? Um, Dr. Wait. Mr. <laughs> Pearson? No. no. Prick or something. <laughs> Why do we always have to bring it back to penis? I don't know. <laughs> Mr. Was prick. It, he had the red hair. Was that the one that got you in trouble for uppercutting the flowers? <laughs> oh, I'm getting the side. There's so many side, 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 side stories here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so 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 I'm up. a tragic story we're building. Yeah, up yeah. Up well, that, that's what I'm... That, this whole time I've been thinking in yeah. the back of my I mean, head. What, what so happened to the shit in the since, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> since we started this, we had Kyle in who got ambushed in Afghanistan and that was a crazy fucking mm, story. Okay. And then we had... Might be... We, had a, no, no, no. we, had, a, <laughs> we had a pro MMA fighter last week talking about a crazy weight cut where he almost killed himself. Yep. And now you guys are like, <laughs> we had 7-Eleven pins in a tree force. <laughs> <laughs> Still good. This is good too. Yeah, yeah, no, no, I'm, I'm, tell you I'm, why, I'm, I'm waiting to, to see where it goes. This might be even more tragic. I love it. <laughs> oh, yeah. Afghanistan story. I, I, want, <laughs> I, I haven't heard it yet. Uh, yeah, yeah, I, yeah. I can't, hey, like, there's no... I'm, I'm waiting. There's no I'm, measurement. I'm, I'm keen, saying it. I'm keen to hear where this goes. So, so your mum's vouched for you. So the vouch found, and for me, the teacher, she she came in and she goes, the deputy principal, I sit down and she's across from me she goes... We know you've been wagging school. Mm. Now, I don't know if my sister has covered for me. Okay. But in my head, I just backed him in that she had. Yeah. Mm. You so I said, that. that's not true. Um, you can call my mum right now and she'll vouch for me. So there's a moment and she goes, oh, I'm not sorry about that. I thought that um, the deputy principal says this. So she goes and calls in one of the other teachers from the admin mm. and she goes, Richie here saying that... Um, he wasn't wagging school. And so the teacher had this look of panic. Yeah. And I knew right at that got moment him. I got him. Because <laughs> that teacher was lazy. Yeah. And they just assumed that yeah. I... And so they went, she went away. She comes back. The teacher says, oh, yeah, it's true. Like, um, he was sick. I, we verified with the parents. Really? That's what the teacher said. And then the deputy principal apologised. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we had this infinite pass. After that, we were free. Yeah. So what do we think we're going to do? We Take just six more trees. Yeah. <laughs> Never go to school. That's yeah. right. Yeah. We had Pamela Anderson, lollies. <laughs> we had the jumping tree. We had everything. 
And yeah. We, and we had, had the, the mates. World. We did. The yeah. world was our oyster. And yeah. we'd have random pop ins from our mates from the crew. Like me and Jay were full timers, but oh, we had like right. part timers that would join us. You know? It was like a job. We were there every yeah. day, you know, tilling nuts. The earth. Was there initiation to this gang? There yes. was actually, as the grand gang grew, they had to do weird stuff. Like, <laughs> Jason Groves, like, remember how Jason Groves You've got to clean the like, shitter. <laughs> yeah. We just kept pooping on top of it. Like, just kept disappearing. I don't know what happened with that. But like, Jason Groves, was a, he came in late, but, um, and uh, subsequently people that came in after him got some really rubbish nicknames. I don't know if you remember <laughs> some of the nicknames that they got. Like Surge Farm and yeah, Bob and stuff, yeah. yeah. Anyway, Bory, but Bory was a bad one. Yeah, but uh, um, sewage farm was worse actually. Uh, but uh, Jason Graves had to stand on a green ant's nest oh. for <laughs> like for how long was it? Like I don't know. It was like something like five minutes, and like on the four minutes thirty seconds, we pushed him off it. So he had to do it all over again. Like, <laughs> you know, one of those things. Like we were bastards. We? <laughs> it's this is totally going to be worth it. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to love this game. <laughs> it's a, we were popular. It was a great game. If you yeah. stick yeah. with that as your name, we'll now it's what we known as Bory. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so uh, the, what happens is in the end is so, so we're in there and mm. um, yeah, we're wagging the school and whatnot. And then uh, one day, hey, am I skipping something? No. How long? How long did we get? The streak to go to. Uh, we was the first three weeks, and then we did like another six. So we had, had nine we weeks nailed, off school. It was just shy of a term. That one, it was getting, a whole, it was it getting is, wild. That's a whole term. It was, a, it was getting wild. It was good. That it was, was pretty good. Anyway, so the story is: is in the cubby there was like this giant tree that had fallen, and it was imagine like it was like ten meters up. Yeah, it, it felt when we were kids. It felt like twenty meters, but I don't know. It, probably ten meters. Yeah. Or eight meters. Ten or meters is still really yeah, yeah. high. It was a high tree, but let's see. At the bottom of the tree, there was all these fauna and mm-hmm. plants and stuff. So you jump off into it, and it was kind of like a cushion. Okay. And Onto so we would swing on vines and jump and stuff. And then one day, me and Jay were wagging school. It was just us two, mm-hmm. and Jay went first. And I, I jumped off. George of the jungle style hit the vine. Yeah. It was a slippery and treacherous day, <laughs> and uh, but. No one had ever swung as far out to hit the rock. Like, <laughs> where'd the rock come from? It was always there. Oh. It's just because we're just jumping off. And it was a bouncy like tree, and but then the vine got us further and further, right? And I went off and I was, oh, there's a rock there. It's a bit dangerous. And you were like, is it all clear? <laughs> and yeah. I was like, yes. <laughs> So like I, I after he goes, so so all the padding that was there is no longer there, and yeah, I um, rock. I went to jump on the. I was in my head. I saw the vine, and you know you see movies, and you think, oh, I'll swing on the vine, I'll do like a flip and land yeah. on my feet. But what happened is, in, in theory, it made sense. It made sense in my head. Yeah, but I swung on the vine, and I. What happened is I swung, and I landed just. I just landed on my face, to be honest, on the ground, but. <laughs> But somehow I broke my arm, you know, so... It was gross. <laughs> Wobbly arm. Really? It was a filthy it was, break. It was so, bad. Oh. so we're in the bush, just me and Jay on a school day. <laughs> like deep in the bush. Yeah. Like it took a while to get to there. Well, like yeah, yeah. yeah you're going in there. So, um, and I've got a broken arm, so it's all flopping around. So I'm oh. like, I'm in pain and I go, all right, Jay, I need something, man. So Jay tries to go to the corner shop to get us a sling. No, first you go <laughs> rip your shirt and right. make a sling. And you couldn't rip it. That's not what happened. <laughs> you make me sound like I sound like I'm some sort of pussy. I had my best Ren and Stimpy shirt on. Oh, oh fuck! Ren and no, I didn't want to rip it. Shirt. It yeah, was yeah. like very popular for us, yeah. and so I was like, I, I pretended to rip it. <laughs> it's here. Yeah. I said, like, I can't. can't anyway, do so it. Jay runs off and he goes to get me a sling. What did you come back with? Okay, well, I don't know why this is all my fault, but like, I go to the Hungry Gnome, the local fish and chip store. Okay. I was like, my friend's broken. For a swing? Arm. Yeah. What's the closest place we get? Give me what? some butcher paper. <laughs> <laughs> it would have been better if I got butcher's paper. Comes you know, like. back, I'm like, did you sit and eat fish and chips? <laughs> so, $2 got you a lot of chips back then, man. Like, anyway, I did not stop for a, you know, some chippies. Yeah. I, I, I needed some sort of cloth. They give me a, like a hand towel. <laughs> it, it was 
Slightly larger than what a normal... Anyway, he runs back. He's got this little towel, and I wrap it up. And it's up here on my neck. You know what I mean? <laughs> it was doing more damage than it was ever. <laughs> really <laughs> painful. Yeah. Assistance. So anyway, we're walking, uh, and I'm like, I stuffed the thing, so I just put it in my shirt, you know what I mean? And I uh, we get back to Jay's house. Now we're now we're scared because I like we've been wagging the school yeah, right? yeah. So for like ten trouble. weeks, and we know it's all going to come down as the this house is, comes. This is turning into like this is where it all comes yeah. undone. Yeah. So I call my brother, my older brother. He's about ten years older than me, and okay. I'm like, mate, can you help us out? You know, we're in trouble. I broke my Hook arm. A brother you know, we, we need help. Wagging school. You know, and brothers, you know, they'll help you when they need you. Yeah, yeah. When you need them. But uh, he's like, oh, dude, I've got a date, man. Like, he goes, I can't come out. I've got a girl all over here. I go, oh, come on, man. Like, I broke my arm. And he goes, I can't, Rich. I've broke, call someone else. And he hung up. <laughs> dude, bros before hoes. Yeah, Except when it's. Uh... Looking back now, I can see, like, you know, well played. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah. you got to do what you got to yeah, do. For sure. uh, so, anyway, um, Jay's stepdad, who was yeah. actually a really nice guy. Um, and drug dealer and drug dealer yep. Jason's house was also by the by the way the largest drug house <laughs> in Queensland in South Sunshine Coast and really? it was yeah. subject of a sting true so, yeah. that's a completely different story that's another yeah, yeah. story so anyway wait yeah. wait wait <laughs> I've got a story about that as well. It, it was yeah. it was bugged. His house was bugged. They, they would have bugged. They would have had my voice, your voice, and it was it was huge. That's was nuts. Massive. Anyway, so his drug dealer stepped that. Uh, <laughs> it was really my mum. Well, your mum was the she was the but green he liked thumb. it. Yeah, loved of course, it. everyone loved it. Um, oh, straight loved it. What are you talking about? <laughs> so his stepdad had taken it. me to the hospital. Yeah, you're good. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> You said what? Um, you remember when they were what the what they had to do is they put a um, so yeah. Alan takes you to the to the hospital, yeah, and the doctors have a look at you, and your arm is messed up. It's all blown up. It's been hours. Fuck. <laughs> 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 He's got a, he's got a tea towel. What have you got a tea towel around your neck for? Is this some sort of like Scooby Doo fashion statement yeah. thing? Like. There's a staff infection in there. Yeah. Oh, shit from the cubby house. He's like, he smells of, he smells of fish and chips. Yeah. <laughs> Why do you smell like oil? <laughs> and the doctors, what they, how'd they help you? Uh, they had to do some procedure, you know, um, where they like they wrap it up. I don't know if they do this anymore, but they put like a, they, you know, when they cut off the blood. And oh. they wait till your arm goes black. So your arm goes full black. <laughs> True. This, Straight this black sounds this. archaic. It yeah. sounds outdated. You know, i got to be honest. Yeah, uh, yeah. So when it goes like that, what they do is they get it and he pops it. Something was out that they had to pop in. They so reset they, your arm. They reset some something. And then, um, but I remember before they did it, the guy had never done it before. And, I, <laughs> and we were overhearing him talk to another doctor guy and said, how do you do it? You just like, go like this. <laughs> and he's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. you got to go like this. You grab it. And you got that, you know. Anyway, so it wasn't great for my confidence. <laughs> so you're going to practice on me? Yeah. <laughs> it was like, what's yeah, it was? Yeah. So they did it and, uh, you know, it hurt and whatever. And then um, they put me in a cast. But uh, So I was okay. But the fallout was the issue, right? This is this is a tragic story. So at this stage, who's with you? Just Jay and his stepdad? Just me down. and Jay, yeah, and his stepdad. Yeah, yeah right, and, okay. You know, my, my dad comes after I've just had it all done. So. I mean, he and, gets it. and, you know, we had it all. We were the kings of... You know, kings of kings. Yeah, yeah. We had unlimited days off school, <laughs> unlimited lollies, Pamela Anderson, yeah. kitties. Sounds like the perfect childhood. Yeah. Yeah, masturbating every day. Just just back that, on. That button. <laughs> <laughs> this is one thing about the school thing that's been annoying me the whole time. Did you guys do like a roll call? Well, back then, how they did it was um, you only had one in the morning. Okay. And that was it. So there was a roll call in the morning. So you used to go for that, did you? Well, no, we didn't, we didn't even do we that. We didn't even do that. But you didn't get it every class like you did later. Yeah, but you yeah. get it every subject. Right. But what I don't understand, so when <clears throat> they didn't they didn't used to call if you missed every day. It didn't work like that back then. Okay. So if you'd missed the number of days, they might call, they might not, but there was no secure rule. Okay, mm-hmm. right. And so, um, but, you know, um, I had my foul safe. Yeah. My sister. Yeah, yeah. And we weren't worried about no, I was so sending notes in on a weekly basis. Yeah, that, yeah. no, no, no. Yeah, because I remember when I was at school, it was like in the morning, then after lunch, then yeah, before you went home. Yeah. yeah. It got I'd, stricter, but I get the sense that the admin weren't doing what they were supposed yeah, yeah. to do anyway. I reckon yeah. they were just like fudging their responsibilities. Yeah. Right. After. You know, after what we did, Queensland education. <laughs> yeah, that's why. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So like, uh, I'm right. to do something. 
So back so we, in the well, we had it all. Yeah, right? yeah. Yep. And we had all the friends. We all go into the same school. And then it tragically, tragically came undone. Um, all the parents came and found out because they were, they were wagging. What everyone was wagging it <laughs> like periodically, but we were wagging it so much. And then all the unexplained absences came in. All the parents were called in. It's huge intervention. They found the it's the, like the cubby. It's the treasure trove of, you know, Pamela Anderson and the lollies, <laughs> like uh, hordes of turds, <laughs> just. Hold up! It yeah. looked bad. The Pamela Anderson's were all wet from the rain, but it looked like <laughs> right. jizzing all over them. Plus, there was jizz all over them. Oh, yeah, plus the jizz. Yeah. <laughs> the rain really helped us out. <laughs> it. it was uh, it was brutal, and um, they took us all, separated us. Yeah, all, all different schools. True. Um, Me and you didn't get. Oh yeah, we did too. Yeah, yeah. It, it, they shut it down. Burnt the. The cubby down. <laughs> it was it was it was really bad. Literally burnt. Like actually burnt they it. they took it all down. They ruined it. They, there was an old <laughs> stinky couch, <laughs> and they just and they just wrecked it. Like and that was it. And that the was end the of end binnies. of the binnies. Yeah, the binnies game. We, that was really sad. It was a sad time. Yeah, we took everything away from us, and we were like, it can't get any worse. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you, you Are you thinking have- of re? Reforming the gang. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. You guys need to do like a vlog and go back and visit the tree. Oh, the tree? No, it's all they all bulldoze. It's literally it's, oh fuck! What they bulldozed well, it? Well, I don't know. It might be no, there. no, no. They didn't. But now it's all they. You know, made the cubby was smashed. The pieces, yeah. like what was there. But it, I went back years later, and it was like, it was did someone forest. make this cubby, or is it like a natural? It was like a, just a natural forest. Uh, I reckon like, that couch got there from some old hobo or something. <laughs> Didn't grow there. Well, it it was someone weird. brought it there. <laughs> <laughs> well, you you'd go into the bushes. It was like a big bush, and then you go in, and like, and there was two entrances. One was like a little hole, like a little tunnel on the floor, and you crawl through. Mm. And there was another way where you could walk in. But once you got in. It was like a giant clearing, uh-huh. and then bunches of little like, um, just I don't know stations. We made yeah. little huts and stuff. So our oh, last time I went there, it just looked like forest, and there's nothing. Like it was just right, true. Yeah, grass and trees and whatever. But uh, that was a pretty bad day. Yeah, it's crazy. It like amazes me because when I was younger, I used to do shit like that as well. Like go. You'd go in the middle of like a paddock. Wait, you masturbated to Pamela? <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, it was like grass up to your neck and shit and like yeah. go climbing under trees. And now I get scared to like walk through grass that's up to my ankle in case there's like a snake or something. Like, Well, you get bitten awesome by bindies. stuff and you'd be like, I got bitten by something. And you would go, what was it? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> See how you wake up tomorrow. You It'll don't be know all right. if it's going to get irritated. Oh, or remember like, when he, sick. Was it Scotty that was bitten by that spider? You, he started vomiting. Yeah, that was oh. pretty And he was like, I got bit by a spider. I go, what did it look like? And he was trying to describe it. But like, he started vomiting. Yeah. Well, like, he'll be right. Have a lolly. <laughs> <laughs> he was all right. Yeah. Yeah. Have a Maz. Yeah. <laughs> Come back. You'll Hamler be fine. Yeah. <laughs> He's in there crying. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they're, they're the best yeah. kind. It's raining on the magazines again. <laughs> <laughs> fucking hell. Well, yeah, that's a pretty crazy story, boys. Pretty, yeah. pretty fucking nuts. Back on the... Um, do you Take that, talk? Kyle. Yeah. <laughs> hey, yeah. you, you piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> so that story about your place being the biggest what drug? Oh, yeah. Look, um, can you talk about that? Or yeah, look, uh, we had a few. We had a few yeah, yeah. Um, stories that we thought, you know, can we get in trouble for this if we admit to any crime? Well, yeah, you don't. You don't have to talk about it. I mean, oh, no, I'll talk about it. Well, look, <laughs> this fine. this used to be a meth fucking meth lab in here. In this room, really? yeah. <laughs> Interesting, impressive, isn't it? <laughs> when you say used to, yeah. you mean it used to, and it still is. <laughs> Before you got here, wait, 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 yeah, yeah right. what's under the table? Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> nah, so we we bought it, and then my wife and I had a home invasion about three or four weeks after we bought it, and like people came in with guns and shit. Oh, looking, really? Looking for Gangsters. the drugs that used to be. Well, that yeah. story's way worse than our story. That was only like, <laughs> that was only like thirty seconds. <laughs> Yeah, we were, we looked, we had no more Freddos. <laughs> <laughs> and that day, I was really upset. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, okay, yeah, that's pretty bad. That's that's horrific. <laughs> I should have gone second. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it just our story is just crap. No, it's not. <laughs> no, I, I told James you can't tell that to anyone because anyone that says that I, they've yeah. got a bad story and you're like, hang on a minute. My issue is I've got a couple of hectic stories that I never knew were like that hectic until I started telling people and like. As I'm telling them, their faces are just like yeah. getting wider, and I'm like, 
This isn't normal. No, no, it's not. To be on the lounge room floor with no. your wife staring at it's each other not. with a gun to your temple. It's so dark. <laughs> oh, so we, we were saying how dark because we, you know, obviously that's not our darkest day. You know, but uh, the old breaking up of the binnies. Uh, uh, but like uh, we thought, oh, I, we, how it's dark? Light, it's we lighthearted. Go? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was. Uh, you, brought, a, you, you, you brought the mood down. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. I, I was in a gang when I was younger as well. Did I, have I told this on the no, podcast yet? I haven't heard about it. Really? Wow. So, well, well, it can't have been as no. hardcore as the Binnies. No, yeah. it was, it's, it's like so to be honest, it was a pretty fucking gay gang. <laughs> <laughs> Literally. So you're like, we all like double-headed giants holding each other's dick. No, no. <laughs> so I swear I've told this on the podcast. Maybe. There used to be a gang yeah. at our high school. They yeah. called themselves a gang. And I forget the name of that gang, but it was like, it started with a P and a P, and this used to be their game Penis sign. and penis. It's probably something like that. Anyway, one of my mates comes up to me and he's like, oh, let's do a rip-off gang and we'll call oh. ourselves the Beanie Boys and that can be our <laughs> The Beanie Boys. Yeah. <laughs> Hang on. And so I'm just, like, just before you go on, yeah. that's, a, that's a D and a B. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that okay. symbol is a D and a B. Like, I don't I, understand. I, we clearly took boys. too many days uh, off school. I shouldn't have been in high school. <laughs> okay. So as it is. Just, just so you know. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Anyway, I'm like, fuck yeah, let's do it. We start recruiting and shit. And then I like say to him, I'm like, oh, what are the Beanie Boys? Like, what does it mean? And he's like, oh, you can only be in the gang if you have your foreskin. (laughs) (laughs) And I'm circumcised, but I'm a a founding member of the Beanie Boys. I can't come clean now. So I'm just recruiting all these like foreskin kids (laughs) at the school. And you were like, meanwhile, their leader is just fucking... Yeah. So so you were like the Hitler (laughs) of the German race. Yeah, 100%. You know, you're not even German. Yeah. And luckily, nobody asked to see mine because I was like, "So you, Wait, you asked not, to see other people's?" Uh, no, I never join. I, show me. I think it got to that. I think I phased out a little bit, and I think it got to that point where, where people, what do you have to show the whole thing, or you could just pull the skin out? I, again, I didn't look at anyone's skin, so I don't know. I, I'm gonna call BS on that. I think no, uh, I swear, someone I saw s- some penises in their day. People saw penises. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, people. Can, I, <laughs> can I ask why? Why the prerequisite was that you had to have four skin? I don't know. I think no, it was beanies. just something he thought of on the spot. It was yeah. like beanie boys. You so got like helmets, you got beanie. You yeah, got helmets right. and beanies, right? Yeah. Yeah. You're a helmet. Yeah. <laughs> it's like America. Which is fine. America has the bloods of <laughs> the crib. Yeah. <laughs> it's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> Yeah, not many Asian people brother? circumcised yeah. around here. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you my Asian brother here, he's beanie. Huh? Yeah. Where, yeah. Make a piss where did you get that statistic from? <laughs> uh, 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 hang on, let me just check the statistics. Uh, <laughs> yeah, the wind's blowing north. <laughs> oh, fuck no. But yeah, that's, yeah, that's, that. that you want to say that's gay, I know you too. Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 I don't. I want to, like, because I'm inclusive. Yeah, yeah. thanks. No, appreciate it. It Me used too. to be annoying because you'd watch, like, all the American movies and shit and they'd, like, Talk about being circumcised, and then in Australia, it's like you have to be non-circumcised, and I'm like, fuck, well, I can't win. You should start a helmet gang. Yeah, <laughs> right. the it's rival completely gang. Completely normal for a 31 year old man to go to the yeah. shops and be like, want to join my helmet gang? Absolutely, the helmet heroes. My um, you know, in you asked earlier about uh, the my house, yeah, yeah, my upbringing. Um, mm. In my teenage years, my mum grew marijuana. Nice. And I used to... Not a little bit of it. Heaps of it. Heaps of it. So much. And uh, I I was on the second story and the buds would be... Like I could open my window and pick some buds. Yeah, right. It's true. Yeah. Yeah, Yeah, but if you ever took anything they knew, no one was allowed to touch it. No, no, you wouldn't. Yeah, you'd get in trouble. You got in trouble. (laughs) You had to be sneaky. You don't have to go to school, but if you touch this (laughs) fucking shit. Yeah. (laughs) Oh, yeah, definitely. And it was uh, was pretty rough. And there was one time we are getting... Like they raided us and me and Richie upstairs and under the mattress is all this bu- like weed just drying out under the <laughs> yeah, mattress. Yeah. And they're like stalling them and we're trying to like flush it down the toilet. Like we knew that we didn't, I mean, oh, we don't even know what they're there for. Yeah. We're like, we're just kids. We? we just knew that they were like talking to his mum all the time and mm. come around. And we would have been like 12, 12. or something. Flushing Tons of weed. <laughs> trying Why? to, trying it's to just save it. Because in our heads we thought, oh no, if we don't do this... You know, jail, his mum's yeah. going to go to jail. <laughs> the gang's over. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so we're trying to flush stuff, but if you flush weed in the toilet, it just comes to the surface. Yeah, yeah. Well, we don't top. know how to flush drugs. We don't know what well. we're doing. <laughs> we're we're, trying, we're that trying to eat it. <laughs> yeah, we're <laughs> trying to digest it quickly to save. But anyway. Yeah, yeah. But you were, I just remember you were bugged and the guy came in That's and he was like, he down. said, um, he said, no, I know you're okay. He yeah. said something like that. And uh, 
we look. <clears throat> Sounds, it's just, there's too much backstory. Yeah, but yeah. We had yeah. a whole bunch of um, fishermen that would stay in <laughs> here. Obviously. So it was a big house, all these rooms, and then you know how the fishermen go away for, you know, months and yeah. then come back and need a place to stay for two weeks. Sort of. I, have but drugs. No, sure. I don't. Yeah, it was like a halfway house. You know, I'm, I'm surprised I didn't get raped, <laughs> like, growing up. <laughs> like, yeah, there was, it was rough <laughs> yeah. upbringing. And, uh, you know, with the drugs there, the parties and all that yeah, sort of stuff. Sure. Police. Fuck, that's sick. The women. Pamela Anderson, she's just coming around. You know, I'm pretty sure. I t- I'll tell you a funny story. One time, um, my uh, girlfriend, she uh, reckoned that there's this group. This is a bit dark, but this is way dark if it's what I think. Yeah, it is. yeah. Anyway, she she thought that <laughs> we're like, not twelve anymore. Open the door. We're not twelve anymore. This is a few years later. Okay. And she, um, before I got with her, she said that she was spiked. And some stuff happened. Hence yeah, why right. he does a sweet, yeah. slit. sweet slit. You know, <laughs> yeah. always you know laugh now, but you know, I'm not the one going to get raped. When, yeah. That's when what you, I who gets the last one? When your <laughs> virginity <laughs> is intact. Yeah. So yeah. when she was crying and telling me, I said, "Well, you should have had the sweet slit." <laughs> um, you know, <laughs> I could have chose a better name. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> um, anyway, um, so she was upset. So I said, "What do you want me to do?" Because she was going, and she said, "I want you to waste them." Yeah. So she was hardcore. She's <laughs> she, was from, a, she was from she was New, New Zealand, and yeah. she, she had a rough past herself. So, yeah. but I was an idiot, and I was like, "Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> got <laughs> it." So yeah. let me get the guys. Yeah. <laughs> she wasn't like, uh, you know, she was a bit more hardcore than mm. the Binnies. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. just she a wee bit. Like, just out of my league, league, if I'm being honest. But me and uh, so I said, "All right." I wasn't planning on wasting anyone, right? But like, <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to have the appearance of like scaring someone, so I went and got somebody. But like, like a bit of background here as well. Like, she was hot. Yeah, right. But the hot, you know, you got your hot, crazy yeah. scale. Mm. Yeah. 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 We're that, there. We're, we're at the end of the scale. <laughs> yeah, we're at the end of the scale. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, I get Jay and I get his brother and, um, and we go down and uh, I see this guy. Uh, and I, I think I he's... We had a Fijian guy, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So he's no longer around <laughs> okay. at this point. Yeah. 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 So, so it was just you, me and Dave. Me, yeah. And um, I brought... My nunchucks. Well, hang on. Hang on. <laughs> like, That's so mean, Asian no, of you. What do you mean? He doesn't tell me. First of all, he doesn't tell me he has nunchucks. <laughs> so well, what, what are we doing here then? We can, <laughs> we like, hang on a minute. The one time we can, I can use my nunchucks. <laughs> you, you expect me not to bring them? So like we go into the, uh, we go into, there's like a public uh, laundromat and he goes in there. So we all go. That's in also so Asian. What yeah. is happening here? No, we, we see him at the place where the, it all went down. We okay. see him, he, and he's like got his laundry. He's coming down the stairs, and we think he's going back into his apartment. But he goes into the laundromat. And we go in straight after him. Yeah, and close the Before door. Before the door gets closed, we get in there. Anyway, so I start talking to him. Now, I'm, I'm lying. I'm like, you know, the Mongol mob want to get you. Oh, I don't know. I just <laughs> like, I don't know what I'm saying. We went from Binnies to <laughs> Mongol mob. <laughs> in a matter like, of moments. He starts confessing things he shouldn't. He starts going, oh, you don't understand. Like, I didn't do it. Like, you know, I have to pay for sex. And like, oh, nobody wants me. He's doing <laughs> but, I didn't, but he's like, I didn't do it. It wasn't me. It was his, my roommate. So we don't know what we're supposed to do. You know? we, I just wanted to sh- you know, shake yeah. him yeah, around. Yeah. So then all of a sudden, like in the background, Jason pulls out this pole. <laughs> and he starts unscrewing it <laughs> Dude, it was hardcore, man yeah. like, I look tough <laughs> And he, he dropped he it out I'm wearing crying. a trench coat trench He's already well. He's already right. It was He's no need for nunchucks his pants you had him up on the On the Like On the washing machine You know hmm. Saying like What do you want? You want a broken arm? Do I need to put you in this dryer? <laughs> Broken arm or broken leg? And he's like, oh, I suppose a broken arm. Like, yeah, he said something like he's that. Threatening he's threatening you. <laughs> and, and like, I was trying to bad cop. I thought I was bad cop. Yeah. But we're just we're bad, cop, bad, bad cop, bad cop. Yeah. Bad cop, bad cop. Yeah. And then so Dave the pole, The pole undoes and he lets it go and he goes, shit. And it's just like a numcha. And I'm looking back and I'm kind of like, like, what are you, what are you doing? I'm trying to escalate <laughs> from where he's going. He's, yeah. gonna, he's breaking legs and arms. So I was like, I'm going to have to do some Bruce Lee work. <laughs> Anyway, Do you know how to use them? Not really. But <laughs> I hurt myself a lot, <laughs> but it would have looked cool in the dark. It right. would have, yeah. yeah. it was really cool. This guy's thinking, am I about to get raped? <laughs> <laughs> this guy's is, is that Bill Cosby in the Bill corner? Bill Cosby in here. <laughs> I, like, I come in, I was like, I level 10,000, you mm-hmm. know. Power levels over 9,000, sort of mm-hmm. like Dragon Ball Z power up. Now bring the nunchucks down, the boom. <laughs> what are you doing? You know, Batman style. <laughs> yeah. Did you do it? Did you do it? <laughs> and then... You think he was afraid of me, but who was he afraid of? Dave, yeah. Because Dave, that actually... Edit. Dave had a gun. No, <laughs> Dave 
had the trench coat on. He had a trench coat and gloves. He had like, like leather gloves. Gloves with no <laughs> fingers. We look like a friggin' a band or something. Like I can't think of anyone having bodies. a trench coat without just being a flasher. <laughs> Maybe he was. You never know what. That's why he was afraid. Yeah, that's why he was so scared. Dave, if you know Dave, Jay's brother, Dave, he's a little bit like he'll. He's oh, dude, that's hours and hours of material. Really? But yeah, he's like a. He's he's just one of those guys. Like if he's sitting there staring at you. Like he could do anything's possible. You know what I mean? True. Like, he had that look he's without unhinged. it. Without yeah. So uh, it was good having him so there. But he had long the, hair. He had long he hair, trench coat, trench leather gloves. Leather gloves. <laughs> and he was more afraid of him. Then friggin' psycho with the nunchucks. Yeah, right. I think yeah, I would have been too. Presence. He's like, oh, what's that guy going to do in the corner? <laughs> I was like, don't you worry about him. Did you know what? Anyway, he never confessed to anything. He just kind of was upset. No, that story goes felt on. too bad. He, he <clears> then, <throat> then says, look, I'll let you up in the room. Do you not remember? Oh, that's right. Room? What room? Wait. <laughs> he, he's dwelling with it. And okay. he said, you can wait for the other guy and I'll help you sting it. Like, I'll help you catch him. Oh, that's right. He wanted, oh. the, he wanted to pin it onto someone else. <laughs> that's right. But then no one came. We, and we went up into his room. It was like hours. He's going to come. Wait five more minutes. And like, at this stage... By Dave, the way, we have no idea what we're going to do if we, we find have nothing. out anything. How like, old were you? Like 21. Oh, right. Okay. Huh. Yeah. Yeah. Were we that old? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, it seemed very <laughs> immature for a 21. I got nunchucks. <laughs> 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 anyway, so we're there and then, you know, an hour goes by. This guy hasn't come home yet. And then it was just like, what are we going to do? And then Dave just gets, he snaps and starts tearing up the joint, smashing the TV up, like throwing up beds, like legit. He <laughs> didn't, didn't smash the TV. No, we end up stealing the <laughs> his off. console. He's like, computer comes. I can't <laughs> remember what it was, like an Xbox or something. I don't know. Dude, we trashed the joint and left <laughs> with their Xbox. That's what happened in the end. And remember like afterwards, we were never sure it was him, but we always saw him thereafter at the plaza. Oh, I kept bumping into him. Yeah, you were like, oh, like hey, hello. <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm the mum- mongrel mob, and then, currently buying some chippies at Coles. But, you know, <laughs> I also I, ended up I, breaking up with that girl not long afterwards, so... She was really aggressive. She was hardcore, man. Like she, she was a wild girl. She <laughs> scared me. I was all of a sudden I was rad, like roughing people up. Yeah. Like. you changed, man. I changed. Yeah. You changed. I've, I've I've told this story before, but you guys obviously obviously haven't heard it. But when I first started dating my wife, her ex boyfriend just didn't want any part of it. So he was on like MSN Messenger to me every night. He's like, let's fucking go. Dude. Oh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> How yeah. much, was this dial up internet? Yeah, probably. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, he's talking a big game and shit. Anyway, he's like, fucking tomorrow, meet me at this school, which was near his place. And he's like, it's fucking on. So I'm like, fuck, I'm going to have to fight this guy now. <laughs> going to have to fight this guy for my I business. don't know any Asians. It was my nunchucks. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you should have called me, man. I'll be yeah. there. <laughs> I think I got like one or two of my mates to come just in case he had mates there. I get there and this guy's on a basketball court with a basketball and he goes, let's go one-on-one. On one. And I'm like, do you want? <laughs> it, you was like a, it was like a high school fucking romance movie or something. Like That's we had to play basketball for And the then girl. you had a, like a dance battle afterwards. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> it was the most confusing time of my life. Did, you, did you play it? I, I honestly don't remember. That's what these boys asked last yeah. time, but I don't know. I hope I, you I, I assume know. we probably would have. It would did have been win? too awkward. Yeah, yeah. I was just like, hang on, wait, wait, wait. You went there to fight. Yeah, went to fight a guy. Why didn't you just punch him? Well, I felt bad. <laughs> he's like, too he's positive. He's like, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, check. Yeah, I would have felt, felt bad. He's like, he's, this well, whole like, time he just wanted a friend. He was like, <laughs> yeah. like this guy's a bastard. He's like, really nice. Yeah, yeah. He wants to play basketball with me and be your friend. <laughs> you, you turned up and he's got mad dribble skills yeah. and yeah, stuff yeah. like that. And you're like, oh, I better fight him. Yeah, okay. <laughs> fucking oath. <laughs> Fucking, um, you guys need to start your podcast again, eh? You guys have got stories for days. We got too many. Stories. We haven't even touched on like anything comedy or anything. Mm. No, no, of course. No, not. fuck comedy. Yeah. yeah. This yeah. is comedy to me. <laughs> this is this is real life. We're yeah, talking 100%. like the streets. Yeah. yeah. Or the, the forests and the, yeah. the, and the bush land. The <laughs> real, real life gang stuff. We're the worst gang ever. Yeah. <laughs> We're the worst gang I don't ever. think so. We got, yeah, there was that stage where we were going around with nunchucks and stuff. And when I say we, I when mean, you, you just yeah. keep them with you. You just bring yeah. it and reach out down with you. <laughs> I'll, I'll send you a photo after this. I still got them. Do you know how hard it is to shake a guy down when your friend's behind you with nunchucks? Dude, what are you talking about? I can't about? imagine like, what you're doing. Like, you're here. And well, I'm just holding him going, tell us. Yeah, he, he pulled it out of his shirt or something. It was hidden. It was a pole. And I thought, and why is he getting out of a okay, pole? Whoa, whoa, whoa. 
you, they're, like you can unscrew them and inside is a chain. Yeah. yeah. It's pretty hardcore, man. Like, I would have looked tough. I never knew that I they I think it would be better as a pole. Yeah, yeah. probably. <laughs> be easier to move around. <laughs> less like, less impressive. Yeah, if, you, if you're if going to get into a fight, you want yeah. to keep that as a... Just That's a, it, yeah. It, it'd be like you with that. That'd it's be level up. Impressive yeah, as just a bottle opener, but you've got to fucking yeah. spin it around yeah. every podcast. You do. That's it. But uh, yeah, spinner. I mean, all it it was intimidating. Yeah, I mean, well, if he didn't, you know, not knowing who you are, he probably <laughs> thought this guy's a pro. He's been sitting there, uh, freaking John Wick's trying to kill me. <laughs> Some nunchucks. <laughs> <laughs> it's like uh, he would have been afraid. Yeah. Does oh. your your brother Dave, does he look more like Dave Kroll than you? Dave looks like, do you remember a... Uh, <laughs> oh, Dave. Dave, mate. Oh, he's beautiful. He, uh, he's, the, he's the missing link. He's the missing link. You see him in every place you go in the world. You see people really? who look like he's him. He's one of those guys. Oh. Do you know, um, I don't know if you, do you watch Rugby League? Yeah. Do you, oh, you might not remember. Matt, Matt Singh. Singh. Yeah, Matt Singh. Singh. If you look at Matt the, Singh, he looks like that. Yeah, right. But he looks like everyone. And he looks like everyone. You see that look. Is that? Do you think that's better or worse? If he looks a bit like wrong? you, actually. <laughs> <laughs> it's been Seriously. Dave this whole nah, time. Yeah. <laughs> no, I need to sing. Oh, yeah, Matt no. Sing. Yeah, Matt Sing. He is Matt Sing. And yeah, he was. He's crazy. Like one time. Uh, how much time do we have? Do we have time? Dude, you don't want to. What time? Are you don't. You don't want to say anything about Dave, man. No, I'll. I'll edit. Just edit his name out. <laughs> no. Don't no say anything I, about what about the, the knife throwing? Yeah, Dave's the type of guy I probably listen to this. He'll never hear you it. Know. Shout out to my brother. Sounds like I have a lot of editing to do. Yeah. Yeah. Leave so him out. David calls me up. And says, oh, all right. Let's put him in then. <laughs> <laughs> You've already said his name. Yeah, but you're going to tell a story about him. No, this is not about him. It's about the knife throwing man. Uh, so yeah. Dave's friend puts him <laughs> <Yeah>. in. <laughs> so Dave calls us up and he's like, hey, I, re- I think it's really important for you and Richard to learn how to throw throwing knives. Okay. okay. That's how random he is. Yeah. Is I found this guy. It's a good skill. Yeah, it's a good skill. Like, it's on, I mean, it, I mean, we got the nunchucks. Yeah, you've got, <laughs> you've got a knife right there. Like, imagine yeah. if you could throw it and hit a target. Like, yeah, it would imagine. be cool. Yeah. It would be cool to do. So we thought, okay, we'll give it a go. Not a be- best judgment, I would dare say. But this guy was, you know, when we found the address, he lived in like, uh, you know, you know, warehouse. He lived in the warehouse where okay. his knife throwing school was. Right. And David was his star pupil. <laughs> and uh, we rock. He's got his green belt. <laughs> this is where. Why were we late? What happened? I can't remember. We're at the shops or something. Shaking down kids at laundromats, <laughs> <laughs> making cuties. And, and, uh, and when when Dave gives you the call to be somewhere, yeah. and uh, it's knife throwing, <laughs> he says, "Don't be late." I think, okay, well, maybe we should be on time. But Richie's like, "No, nah, it's all right. We'll go get you know, go to Coles, <laughs> you know, get something." Shout out to Coles, a uh, friendly sponsor. <laughs> <laughs> We've got a lot of sponsors. Yeah, they. Yeah. Uh, and uh, we rock up to this place and this guy was here and Dave had said something because we were late. He said something to this gentleman who was teaching us how to throw knives. And then I rocked up. What, was it you or me that said? It was something? you. I yeah. said, oh, yeah, we were late because, you know. You yeah. told a reason and it was different to Dave's reason. <laughs> and, the guy, <laughs> it was di- and this guy... What do you say, Richard? You bring it. I'll bring you in for this because he, he came just up said, "I'll stick this knife up your bloody nose." It went I, off, and it was he was inches away with a throwing knife. With a massive Richie, knife, Richie's face. Like, I was like, "Why are you putting it in my face? <laughs> <laughs> I don't even. I'm not nothing to do with this." And uh, you know, at that stage, you think you just walk away, like. Mm. No, but we took the knife class and uh, <laughs> left out of throwing knives. He was aggressive the whole time. Oh, as dude. Well. He said he was the guy that said I could kill you with a pack of cards, a deck of cards. And he's a wild man. And he was like, <laughs> yeah, he's like, I'll just I'll put it together, hold it tight, I'm punching up your nose. <laughs> Referring up to the nose. Yeah. yeah, he had some fetish with those or something. Which which one of you two do you think is like the bad influence that keeps getting you which into these? He's probably the bad influence. Why am I the bad influence? <laughs> <laughs> he said it instantly. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't know. Remember that time where you, uh, you convinced me to steal Dave's car? <laughs> oh, <wait. laughs> I mean, we was a team story. effort Team effort oh, You were the one dude, with your learners Dude how long have we been here for We've <laughs> got all these stories yeah, man We've been here for just over an hour Oh, yeah. What oh, time? You, the, yeah, yeah. What time are you guys gonna? Well, we gotta go soon to yeah, the okay. Gold Coast. But, yeah. um, we got we got a gig on the Gold Coast. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Comedy. Oh, comedy. Oh, comedy. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mano's, Mano's bar. Mano's, Mano's bar. bar. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I did that a couple of months ago. That's a great spot. Yeah, was it full when you were there as well? Yeah, it was packed. So you've already been down to do. 
Jigsaw. We're going tonight. We're going okay. tonight, yeah, to, to some Manos. You've done it before? We did it like a year ago, but yeah, I haven't okay. done it since. Yeah, so. right. Yeah, no, it's a good gig. Um, so it should be fun. Um, anyway, the story was we're 15 or something, and uh, me and Jay, we haven't got our licenses. Uh, hypothetically speaking, <laughs> we stole his brother's car. It was we a, borrowed it. Was, it. <laughs> it was Kingswood. Yeah, it was Kingswood, Kingswood, yeah. Kingswood, like in, you know, leather seats at the bench seats at the front. Mm, it's yep. a stick shift. We don't know how to drive, okay? Like, we're not big car guys, but we get his... Because we met some girls on the chat. MSN. MSN. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> That's where it's at. And, like, you know... Old internet, slow internet. It's really hard to send a dick pic. Yeah, slow yeah, for sure. <laughs> <It's kind of> like, <laughs> <laughs> and you ask for some titty. Yeah. And then, like, he'd be like... You know, it takes nine minutes for the mm. photo to download. Yeah. And then someone picks up the phone. And you're, oh, no! Yeah. <laughs> you're gonna, I've got the biggest blue balls ever. Yeah. So anyway, I went to the blue light disco. And then... Um, they were standing there with basketballs. <laughs> <laughs> Num- we brought our nunchucks. Uh, no, we get there. They weren't even there. So we just at some blue light disco. We stole a car to go to some lame blue light disco in Brizzy from the Sunshine Coast. We drive on the highway. On That's 15. a hectic drive. No license. We snap the car in the um, lock and when we get out... The key. The oh. keys The keys in the so lock. The, it, Richie puts the key to lock the door. There's no central locking back then. It just fell off like a... It was like butter. <laughs> like that. The key is stuck in the lock. I know you're in the lock. Yeah. Like, in the oh, door, have you right? seen my muscles? <laughs> <laughs> He doesn't need nunchucks, this guy. <laughs> you see those muscles? I'm powering through this. This is actually yeah. a long story, but I'll power through it. So yeah. we, we managed to get it out at the end of the night. And, you know, we get it back into the ignition. This is after the blue light. How? Disco where we I'd be so scared light. to put it in the ignition. Yeah, I'll lose sure. it. It took us ages. We were locked. Because we, we, when we locked in, I didn't want to miss out on the night. Mm. So we went to the dance, right? <laughs> so it was just stupid. But we ended up doing our thing yeah. for a few hours. We came back out and we had to get it out. We managed to get it out somehow. I can't mm. remember. We had friends helping yeah. us. It took us hours. By the time we got it sorted with a paddle pop stick and like the end of the key and stuff. We put the key in the barrel, the end, the broken off key mm. in the barrel, and then we shoved a paddle pop stick oh, in there. It's pushing and the, it further. Um, <laughs> the, yeah, the, the Kingswood like ignition has like these little handles that you use to help, you know, right, you know, yeah, yeah, spin, yeah. The, yeah. spin the key in the ignition. So we managed to get it going, but we got back super late. Um, and then the next day, I made, when I got back, I saw that Dave was home, so I left and Jay was just <laughs> 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 I went home. I'd like, stolen my parents' car to drive to Jason's house, and then we stole Dave's car to drive to Brisbane. Mm. So it was a wild night. Fuck. And the so anyway, the VR, um, right? With the gas tank, the gas. What's that? The VR, the red VR. Yeah, VR, yeah, yeah. VR, yeah. yeah. And then uh, in the morning, I went round for school, and Dave had found out that we've taken the car, mm. and ends up having a fight with Jay because Jay's <laughs> playing computer games, beats him, and then Dave erupts, ends up yeah. fighting Jay. Well, this is like, yeah. So I beat him at Street Fighter. I'm pretty good at Street Fighter. <laughs> Yeah, a whole other story, but then um, he finds out that we uh, he's already agitated, and he finds that the car's broken because we shoved the ignition in there at a paddle pop stick, and then we have this fight, uh, you know, at the top of the, ha- the story, uh, at the second story of the house. Now he's Dave's a few old, years older than us, yeah. you know, teenagers. Yeah. Dave uh, beats Jay up and pushes him down the stairs. <laughs> <laughs> it was rough, man. Yeah. I should have told that story. Like, yeah. uh, that was a bad day. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So anyway, show. afterwards, I see I'm opportunistic because I'm like, oh, well, maybe I can get out of school because we love getting out of school. Yeah. So like, I, <laughs> I go, come on, I'll take you home. So I took him home to my house. And I said to my mum, I said, oh, Jay's had a rough night, a rough morning, sorry. He's, um, you know, he got pushed down the stairs. I, I just don't think it'd be right for him to go to school. I think he needs to stay here, knowing that we'd both get the day yeah. off. And then my mum just goes... Oh, well, you're going to school. And I went, <laughs> yeah, of course. Like, yeah. And then I had to go to school on my own. And Jay stayed home oh, and played computer games. Uh, at my time. house. I put some hours He's eating my food, playing my games. Jelly beans and Diablo yeah. 2. It was fantastic. Anyway, <laughs> great day. Crazy fucking story. Well, yeah, I'll let, better let you boys out of here. Love it. Go to your fucking big comedy gig. You guys got, just want to plug anything else you've got coming up? Maybe the, the rebirth of the podcast or anything like that? <laughs> Uh, nah, I've got a solo right. show coming out in three months. Yeah, true. It's at the Good Chat Comedy Club, so okay. Fuck I'm yeah. uh, opening that. Jay's going to be on that night as well. So no, nice. I'm opening for you. You're starring in it, right? Yeah. Well, yeah. The, the yeah. well you don't know yet, but <laughs> <laughs> aren't I? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Keep so please take your nunchucks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you're going to be there. I'll bring them. Yeah, for sure. I'll come along. Yeah. That'll be sick. Yeah, so that'll be a fun night. Um, other than that, not really. Just yeah, keep, okay. keep going. Nice. We're geek pigs. Fuck yeah. Love it. All right. No worries. Well, I'm sure I'll see you around the uh, 
trapped somewhere, but yeah, cheers for coming in. No yeah, problem. Thanks for having us. We'll get you in again for some more crazy fucking stories. Yeah, no Thank you, right. Malcolm. <laughs> Catch up. See you later. <laughs>